Legends of the Sky, from Blackbird to Son of Blackbird, the SR-71 Blackbird, a name that echoes through the halls of aviation history. The SR-71 Blackbird wasn't just another aircraft, it was a marvel of engineering, a testament to human ingenuity and ambition. This sleek black aircraft born in the Cold War became an icon of speed and engineering prowess. Designed to outpace and outmaneuver any threat, it was a symbol of technological superiority during a time of intense geopolitical tension. Reaching speeds exceeding Mach 3.3, it was a spy plane practically untouchable, soaring above the clouds, leaving adversaries far behind in its vapor trail. Its ability to gather intelligence at such high speeds and altitudes made it an invaluable asset to national security. But time marches on, even legends must eventually land. The SR-71, despite its unmatched capabilities was retired, leaving behind a legacy that would inspire future generations of aircraft designers and engineers. Now, a new generation prepares to take flight. The SR-72, potentially even faster, even stealthier, a true heir to the Blackbird throne. This new aircraft promises to push the boundaries of what we thought possible, aiming to achieve hypersonic speeds that could revolutionize aerial reconnaissance and combat. The SR-72, if it lives up to its much-hyped expectations, has big shoes to fill. The legacy of the Blackbird is not just about speed, it's about innovation, resilience, and the relentless pursuit of excellence. The Blackbird wasn't just fast, it was a symbol of American ingenuity, a testament to what happens when brilliant minds push the boundaries of the possible. It represented a time when the sky was not the limit, but just the beginning. So, the question arises, can the SR-72 live up to the legacy of its iconic predecessor? Can it embody the same spirit of innovation and excellence that made the SR-71 a legend? Can it soar even higher, fly even faster and further cement its place in the pantheon of aviation legends? The potential for the SR-72 is immense, but so are the challenges it faces. The story of the SR-72 is one of ambition, technological daring, and the relentless pursuit of pushing the limits of what we consider achievable. It's a journey that requires not just advanced engineering but also a vision for the future of aerial warfare and reconnaissance. It's a story still being written, a high-stakes endeavor where the finish line is constantly shifting, driven by the ever-evolving demands of national security in an increasingly complex world. The development of the SR-72 is a race against time, technology, and the ever-present threats that loom on the horizon. The stakes are high, the challenge is immense, but the potential rewards are nothing short of rewriting the rules of aerial dominance. The SR-72 represents the next chapter in a saga of innovation, a testament to the enduring human spirit to reach for the skies and beyond. The SR-71 Blackbird wasn't just an aircraft, it was a statement, a bold declaration of technological prowess and strategic dominance. Born from the crucible of the Cold War, it was a physical manifestation of American technological superiority, a marvel of engineering that pushed the boundaries of what was thought possible. Developed by the secretive Lockheed Skunk Works, the Blackbird was designed to outrun and outmaneuver any threat, a true testament to the ingenuity and dedication of its creators. Providing crucial intelligence in an era of global tension, the SR-71 played a pivotal role in maintaining the delicate balance of power. Its sleek titanium body, designed to withstand the extreme temperatures generated at hypersonic speeds, was a marvel of modern material science. The Blackbird silhouette became instantly recognizable, a symbol of power and cutting-edge engineering that captured the imagination of all who saw it. First flown in 1964, the SR-71 quickly proved its worth, demonstrating capabilities that were nothing short of revolutionary. It could outrun surface-to-air missiles rendering them practically obsolete and showcasing its unmatched speed and agility. Its powerful cameras captured images with incredible detail from altitudes exceeding 80,000 feet providing a bird's-eye view that was previously unimaginable. These images provided invaluable insights into enemy operations, allowing for strategic decisions that could alter the course of history. The Blackbird became a vital asset during the Cold War, its missions shrouded in secrecy, its flights often cloaked in the cover of night. Its pilots, revered for their skill and bravery, were the unsung heroes of a silent war fought in the skies. Over its illustrious career, the SR-71 set numerous speed and altitude records, many of which remain unbroken today, a testament to its advanced design and engineering. It became a cultural icon, featured in movies, TV shows and video games, capturing the imaginations of people worldwide and cementing its place in popular culture. At air shows, people would gather to admire the Blackbird, marveling at its sleek design and the stories of its incredible feats. The Blackbird represented the pinnacle of human ingenuity, a testament to the power of innovation and technological advancement during a time of global uncertainty, pushing the boundaries of what was possible. 
it proved that with enough dedication and ingenuity, humanity could push the boundaries of what was possible, reaching for the skies and beyond, inspiring future generations of engineers and aviators. The legacy of the SR-71 Blackbird is one of speed, secrecy and unparalleled achievement, a shining example of what can be accomplished when vision and technology come together in perfect harmony. Despite its legendary status and undeniable capabilities, the SR-71 Blackbird was retired in 1999. This decision was met with surprise and sadness from many, who saw the Blackbird as a symbol of American strength and ingenuity. However, several factors contributed to its retirement, marking the end of an era in aviation history. One major factor was the Blackbird's operating costs. As a highly specialized aircraft, the SR-71 required extensive maintenance and support, making it expensive to operate, especially as the Cold War ended and defense budgets shrank. New technologies like satellite reconnaissance also emerged, offering alternative methods of intelligence gathering that were arguably more cost-effective and less risky. Furthermore, the SR-71 despite its speed was not invincible. Advances in surface-to-air missile technology meant that the Blackbird's vulnerability was increasing. While it could still outrun most threats, the risk of being intercepted was becoming more significant. The world of espionage and aerial reconnaissance was changing, and the Blackbird despite its legendary status was struggling to keep up with the evolving landscape of modern warfare. The SR-72, dubbed the Son of Blackbird, represents the next generation of strategic reconnaissance. This aircraft is not just an evolution, but a revolution in aviation technology, promising capabilities that were once the stuff of science fiction. Building on the legacy of its predecessor the SR-72 aims to redefine the possibilities of hypersonic flight, pushing the boundaries of speed and technology to new heights. The SR-71 Blackbird was a marvel of its time, but the SR-72 is set to surpass it in every conceivable way, from speed to stealth to endurance. Envisioned as an unmanned aircraft, the SR-72 promises to be faster, stealthier, and even more capable than the legendary Blackbird. The absence of a human pilot allows for design innovations that were previously impossible, making the SR-72 a true game-changer in aerial reconnaissance. One of the most striking features of the SR-72 is its projected speed. This aircraft is designed to operate at hypersonic speeds, which means it can travel at velocities that are six times the speed of sound. This is not just a minor upgrade, it's a quantum leap in aviation technology. While the Blackbird could reach speeds exceeding Mach 3, the SR-72 is being designed to achieve hypersonic speeds of up to Mach 6, or six times the speed of sound. This incredible speed would allow it to cover vast distances in a fraction of the time it would take conventional aircraft. This incredible velocity would make it practically untouchable by any existing air defense system, allowing it to penetrate heavily defended airspace, gather crucial intelligence, and return to base before even being detected. The speed and stealth of the SR-72 would make it an invaluable asset for any military operation. The SR-72's unmanned design is another significant departure from the Blackbird. By eliminating the need for a human pilot, the aircraft can be designed to endure extreme conditions that would be intolerable for humans. By removing the need for a human pilot, the SR-72 can withstand even greater G-forces and fly for extended periods, potentially staying airborne for days or even weeks at a time. This capability would allow it to conduct long-duration missions that were previously unimaginable. This increased endurance combined with its exceptional speed would allow the SR-72 to conduct missions across vast distances, making it a truly global reconnaissance asset. Whether it's monitoring geopolitical hotspots or gathering intelligence on emerging threats, the SR-72 is poised to become an indispensable tool for national security. The SR-72 will also benefit from advancements in artificial intelligence and autonomous systems, allowing it to make real-time decisions and adapt to changing mission parameters without human intervention. This level of autonomy will further enhance its effectiveness and operational flexibility. The development of the SR-72 involves cutting-edge materials and engineering techniques, ensuring that it can withstand the extreme temperatures and stresses associated with hypersonic flight. This is not just about speed, it's about creating an aircraft that can perform reliably under the most demanding conditions. In summary, the SR-72 represents a bold leap into the future of aviation. With its unmatched speed, endurance, and technological sophistication, it is set to redefine what is possible in the realm of strategic reconnaissance. The dawn of the hypersonic age is upon us, and the SR-72 is leading the way.